tomorrow, we're going to be doing all the countertop skills. Okay. That should take 30 minutes. Uh, hour most. Okay. So we'll have at least three to four hours of practice time. Okay. So same time tomorrow, 7 in the morning. All right? Okay. So we're done? We're done with this? Uh, yeah, after this we're done, then it's your time to practice. Yeah, you'll have about 45 minutes of practice. Okay? Cool. Alright, for uh, peri care, you will need three towels, three towels, four washcloths. A uh, bath blanket. A pair of gloves. A pair of gloves. Chuck pads. Now with your chuck pads, it depends on what your posture provides for you. It could either be a disposable or a reusable. And I will show both. Okay, so make sure you take note. Alright? And it's a bath blanket, right? Yes. Uh -huh. Basin. Soap. Okay? Alright. So first thing, you do your initial steps. Okay? After you do your initial steps, you go ahead and set your equipment up first, or you can set your client up first. All up to you. Okay? So I'll, I'll go ahead and set up my equipment first. I got my first towel. And I line that bedside table. After I line my bedside table, I'm going to grab the rest of my equipment. So chuck pads. Bath blanket. Pair of gloves. Basin. Soap. Okay. Next, we go ahead and set up our client. So I put my client in comfortable working height. Side roll down the working side. <laughs> I grab my back blanket. And I cover my client. Okay? And I have my partner hold on to the back blanket. Will you please hold on to this back blanket, please? Thank you. While your partner is holding on to that bath blanket, you go ahead and put that top sheet all the way down. Do you have a partner? Your other patient that you had? Oh, thank you. Your partner will help you. Oh, okay. She'll, she'll be on standby. Oh, awesome. Yeah, the dummy confuses. <laughs> Next. Check that water for comfortable temperature water. Have your partner check. Okay? Partner says good. Alright, good. After you check that water, gloves on. Okay. Next. You want to check, okay, if chunk pad is provided for you. So first thing I do is check. So in this case, none is provided. Okay? So if it's not provided, all you do is just put one on. Okay? So let's say that this is provided for you. Okay? Disposable. Alright? So I tell my partner, on three, we're going to 
now turn and grab hold that side there. Okay, so one, two, three, and turn. There you go. I'll make sure that your client is covered. So we be using a dummy? Yes. Okay. For Just the way I'm doing it right now. I will wash my hands. Alright. So when you put in this uh, chuck pad, it will be just like bed making. Okay? Put it on halfway. Okay? Holding this or turning this into itself towards you. So if this was. Or, no, before we left, what else? Yeah, it's clean. So it's towards me. It's clean. Okay? Okay. So there you go. In the bed, okay? And we're leaving. What else do we need to get? Have your client turn. You don't need to go to the other side. Okay? You don't have to. Okay. All you need to do is have your partner turn slightly towards you. Okay? Okay. Then you fix that chalk pad. So what can we tell her now? That we're all done. Now you can start with your procedure. Okay? Let's say that a chunk pad is provided. So take note. So let's say that a chunk pad is provided. Back blanket on, top sheet down. You check. Okay, one is provided, and it's a disposable. Okay? You don't need to change it. All you need to do is. Go ahead with your procedure. Okay. Expose your client. If it's a disposable type, all you need to do is fold this into itself. Okay. Now this is your clean area right here, where you can do your procedure. Everyone see that? Okay. Fold it once to clean the front. When you clean the perianal area, turn your client, fold it one more time to clean the area. Okay? That's if this is provided for you. Okay? Let's say it's a reusable type. So you guys have seen this in the hospitals and facilities, right? The reusable chuck pad. Okay? Remember this? Everybody? Yeah. Okay, yep. so let's say that this is provided for you. Okay? So you check. Oh, okay, so there is a chuck pad. It's reusable. You need to remove it. Okay? So just like bed making, fold it into a cell for the client. Grab a clean one. Okay? Just like bed making. Alright? Have your client turn back. Okay? Remove this. Put it in solid linen. Okay. Fix the clean one. And start with your procedure. Okay? Questions with that? Okay. The reason why I have you guys remove it at the beginning of your procedure, we all know that if your client voids on this reusable chunk pad, it will go through. Right? Okay. So you don't have a clean area. Unlike our disposable, it has a plastic barrier. Okay? So this is your clean area right here. Just got that? Okay. So it's all up to the proctor on Friday on what supplies are provided for you for this particular procedure. Okay? You might put one of these, disposable ones. You might put one of those reusable ones. It's all up to your proctor. Okay? Questions with that. But at the end of your procedure, you will replace that chunk pad with a clean new one. Okay? Alright. So, let's start with our procedure. So I put one on, because our proctors didn't put one. Okay? Now, I'm ready to go. Okay. Since I put this on, it's brand new, I don't need to fold it into itself. Okay? I don't need to. But if you want to, just to be safe, that's fine. You're not going to get dinged for that. Okay? Alright, next. Go ahead and grab your first washcloth. Okay? Wet it. 
add soap. Okay? What did you forget to do? Clean from front to back. Do this. Yes, ma'am. Okay? Switch the clean side. Front to back. Switch the clean side. Front to back. This pose. Grab your second washcloth. Wet it. Rinse. Front to back. Switch. Front to back. Switch. Front to back. Okay? This pose. Grab your second towel. Pat. Dry. This pose. Go ahead and follow your client. Tell your partner on three, we're going to turn and grab hold that side row. One, two, and three. Expose the perianal area. Okay. If you fold it once in the front, you'll yeah. fold for the second time. Just like that. Okay. Only for disposable. Alright. Grab your third wash block. Wet it. Add soap. Front to back. Everyone see that? Once again, you do this. Okay. Just fail. Switch up the inside. Front to back. Switch up the inside. Front to back. This pose. Grab your fourth washcloth. Wet it. Rinse. Front to back. Switch to clean side. Front to back. Switch to clean side. Front to back. This pose. Next. Pat dry. Just like that. This pose. Grab your clean chuck pad. Fold this into itself, the soiled one, clean one, fold into itself, towards you, okay? Tuck it underneath that clean, uh, soiled chuck pad, okay? Everyone see that? Under, okay? Have your partner turn, so turn slightly towards me. If it's a disposable chuck pad, this goes into trash on Friday. Okay? Goes into trash. Alright? So I'll pretend it's in trash. Next. Make sure you fix that clean chuck pad. There you go. All right, now, grab the basin, face your proctor, verbally tell your proctor, I am emptying my basin, rinsing it, emptying it, half dry, goes to soil designated area, dispose of remaining soiled linen, make sure your client is covered, Close. Gloves off. Goes to the trash. Verbally tell your proctor, I am washing my hands. After you wash your hands, cover your client. Side row up on the working side. Put the bed in its lowest position. Give the call light, and you're done.